Good afternoon, everyone, on a Tuesday. It's a real damn dreary day out there. Uh, not too much weather to talk about today, but there is uh, weather coming up that is definitely worth talking about. Southern California, the Southwest, in dire need of rain. They're getting a lot of it, almost too much. But see this storm out here, the one affecting this? This is going to make a cross-country journey as we take a fly, you can see. Then this storm is going to wind up somewhere in our area. Now this is what is most likely going to happen. We'll probably see some wintry precipitation move into our area late Thursday into Friday. That is what we're looking into. This is not a done deal as far as the forecast goes. However, uh, we are definitely going to be looking out for the chance at some interesting weather late in the week. Yesterday's computer guidance brought it close enough to bring us a snowstorm. Today's takes it a little bit farther south, but the trend this winter, as I've said before, is to bring these storms closer and closer to the region to bring us snow. So if that trend continues, if past predicts future, then we could be looking at this snow scenario by Friday. Now, in the short term, today we had the cool air getting filtered in as a front move through. Tomorrow, more of the same, some snow up over New England, but here comes our storm. By Thursday, this is going to be knocking on our doors. Main area of low pressure rides into the Great Lakes, secondary develops along the coast. How close that secondary low stays to the coast is the big question mark for Friday. If it moves close enough, and with the cold air in place, uh, we are going to be talking about the threat at wintry precipitation. It is not going to be a super cold air mass, but because this cold air is going to be, it, it's called cold air damming. It just gets bottled up in the area, especially in the valley locations, and as, cold, and as precipitation moves in, rather, it does fall in the form of frozen precipitation. So this is going to be one that we'll continue to be watchful of. For tonight, though, mostly cloudy skies. It'll just be damp and cool, 25 to 30 for the low temperatures. During the day on Wednesday, a mix of sun and clouds, seasonably mild conditions, 38 to 42 will be the high temperature range. The wind, not much of a factor tomorrow. Here is your exclusive BP weather, 10-day extended. We go from the 40s Wednesday into the 30s Thursday. 35 Friday, we're watching that storm. Over the weekend, we warm back up into the 40s. By Monday, another storm heads our way, but this time, temperatures skyrocket. We could be talking about rain and thunderstorms by Monday, with temperatures around 50 degrees, and then by mid to late next week, winter comes back, temperatures plunge back to to where they should be this time of year, maybe more snow by next weekend. But of course, check back for updates on this Friday storm because this could be interesting if everything can come together right. That's your forecast for today. I'll see you tomorrow.